everyone, welcome to another design lesson video. In each video, I'm going to review some key design principles that you should keep in mind when you're thinking about renovating or decorating your space. So if you have a design dilemma and need some answers, feel free to comment in the section below with your questions, or you can tweet me your questions on Twitter at Design Chicky. Your dilemma could become one of these design lesson videos right here. In the meantime, let's get to today's topic. Today I'm giving you my top 5 Benjamin Moore white paint colors. So many people ask me what my go-to white paint color is and I really have to disappoint them because I don't just have one. Color is dependent on so many factors like lighting, sheen, room size, reflection, atmosphere, etc. So one color would never solve all those issues. But I do have some favorites and I'm here to give you just my top 5 picks from Benjamin Moore. So let's get to it. Most white paints have an undertone of another color and my favorite undertone is gray. Decorator's white is the palest of pale gray. It's perfect for kitchen cabinetry when you don't want stark white. Imagine white chalk. I also love it on exterior siding like this. Another favorite gray white of mine is Oxford white. Decorator's white tends to be on the cooler side. Oxford white is warm gray, but again, just a hint of gray. One key way to determine the undertone of your white is to put it next to other colors or other whites. You can see here in this image the white is warm, pale, and slightly gray. I love using Oxford white on moldings because it makes them look like plaster. Another undertone of white is yellow or cream, and in this case there is no better choice for a creamy white than simply white. You may remember it as Benjamin Moore's Color of the Year in 2016. And I think it's still a great choice. Simply White is a beautiful, soft white. It has just a hint of cream, so it lends itself to many interiors. Most people I show this white to agree, it's just beautiful. I love it on doors and trim especially. All the walls and trim work are painted in this color here, and you can see there's a light, pretty look to the room. That's why I love Simply White. Paper White is a favorite of mine because it has a touch of blue. I love using this on walls when I want an all-white room look without it being too bright. I especially love using this color in modern, big, open spaces like lofts. I also love using it in bathrooms where Carrera marble is used. The touch of blue really comes alive next to the blue-gray marble. And finally, you could even call it my number one white paint, Chantilly Lace. Chantilly Lace is a true white. It's what I use as a backdrop when I'm choosing other colors because it's just plain white and you can see all the other white undertones. But there's nothing plain about it. It's a great color for kitchen cabinetry if you're looking for a bright white kitchen. I also love it on trims around high contrast colors like this. So there you have it, my top five Benjamin Moore white paints. Here they are all together. You can really see their undertones when they're next to each other. These are the white paint colors I use most often, but even then I still look at all my color choices at different times of day and in different lighting situations before I finalize the color. So don't forget to get some large samples and try them out yourself. Thanks for watching my latest design lesson video. If you liked the video, please hit the like button, share it with your friends, and don't forget to subscribe. You can follow me on Twitter as well, and if you have any design questions, let me know and it could be the topic of our next video. Plus, if you have some white paints that you love, 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 then add them to the list by commenting in the section below. I'd love to hear about your favorites and how you've used them. Again, thanks for watching this video and I'll see you next time.